Okay, so I'm on my way up a mountain now. It's a beautiful morning. I have had a few brief stops to do a bit of B-roll. I thought the odd snap with the digital camera. But I really want to get up high now. There's no cloud today, I knew that. So I think the choice of the pinhole and the holger is going to be borne out because I think shooting it straight, if you like, will be uh, rather underwhelming. So once I get a bit of height or I get around some of the old mine workings and the the little uh, the little quarries and the flins, I think I'll be able to take some shots. Right, I'm just making an exposure with a pinhole, the first one of the day. I've got a bit of an old quarry of mine, workings abandoned, and a lot of slate around here, and I've got the little pinhole camera set up. And I'm not going to come too far, I don't want to get in the shot because it is exposing at the moment. And I've gone for about a minute. Now the metered reading was around about half a second to a second at f22. And when you extrapolate that for f138, which is the aperture of the pinhole, and a bit of reciprocity failure, about a minute should do it. Not an exact science, so uh, I'm not going to worry too much about that detail. Ah, well, I've reached the top of the, uh, well, almost the top of the mountain now. Just uh, sheltering down here, it's a, bit, it's a bit calmer. And I've got some lovely views. I mean, photographically, it's a little bit too harsh and bright, but in terms of being out and walking, it's absolutely fantastic. Let's, let's look at that over towards Snowdon. Absolutely beautiful. I don't think I've seen it nicer than this before. And I'm just taking a breather. I had a bit of a time lapse. I've taken a couple of pictures with the, the Holger and the pinhole. And I might do a couple more while I'm up here because I've got the uh, got the time, and uh, oh, it's just totally beautiful though, absolutely beautiful. Now in addition to uh, the odd pinhole and uh, standard holger shot, I've taken one of the, uh, the view towards Snowden behind me with the holger on the tripod and I have fitted the little R72 infrared filter. Now this means I've got to use a long exposure of around about a second or two, so I've put the little adapter on which allows me to use a cable release and I've put the filter on in front taken three shots now I've taken them roughly at one second two seconds and four seconds because I have absolutely no idea what the real aperture of a holger is um, so really just one of them hopefully will come out Thank you. 
Well, I'm heading off the off the mountain now. Lovely and frosty. It's still absolutely beautiful. Photographically speaking, not so good though. I've had the big views from the top, but I do get some forest sections back down the bottom near the car, and I'm hoping they'll work for both the Holger and the pinhole. <laughs> 